Hey guys, what's going on? Rick here, behind me, the Universal Globe, and today's video, a beginner's guide to Universal Orlando. Today, we're gonna highlight all the thrill rides they have here. Now, if you are not a newbie to Universal, do not turn away from this video. I might have a Rick's trick or two for you. Plus, there's something really odd about this list. Stay tuned and find out what it is. Today's video will cover both theme parks, Universal Studios Florida right there, and Universal's Islands of Adventure over there. That's where we're gonna start because I think the most thrilling rides are at Islands of Adventure. I do want to mention, I did not create this list. This list comes from the Universal Smartphone app. That's why there's something odd on it. The app divides the rides into four categories, thrill rides, water rides, 3D rides and kids rides. Today, we're just gonna cover the thrill rides. Before we head over to Universal Studios Florida, we're going to make a clockwise trip around Islands of Adventure, highlighting the thrill rides they have here. Kicking off the list, we have the Incredible Hulk roller coaster. With a launch start that leads directly into a drop, Cobra rolls, and like seven inversions this is a true thrill ride at Islands of Adventure. If you like going upside down, you'll love this coaster. If you hate going upside down, maybe not so much. The Hulk is the second fastest ride at all of Universal Orlando Resort. The other thrill ride located in Marvel Superhero Island here at Islands of Adventure is Dr. Doom's Fear Fall. This is a launch tower that will send you flying up into the sky, give you a brief moment of weightlessness before dropping you down again. Yes, the launch and that moment of weightlessness, very thrilling. After that, it's a very relaxing ride. And while you're here in Marvel Superhero Island at Dr. Doom's Fearfall, ask for the villain's tour. It's worth it, trust me. Actually, I did a video on it. I'll leave a link to it in the description box. For our next thrill ride, we have to say goodbye to Marvel Superhero Island and welcome to Jurassic Park. ride on today's list is actually Universal's newest ride and fastest ride. Some of the features that make this a very thrilling ride here at Universal Orlando's Islands of Adventure would be that it has 12 airtime moments, a Mosasaurus roll, a top hat, a zero gravity G stall, and that's just to name a few. I do believe at the beginning of this video I promised you some Rick's tricks, at least one, and here it is. The Velocicoaster, already a thrilling ride. Want to make it a bit more thrilling? Row 11. I have it on good authority from a person who has ridden this ride over 120 times that row 11 is the most thrilling row. This is a new breed of roller coaster. When you're here, give it a try. What could go wrong? The next thrill ride I'm going to show you is inside of the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Hogsmeade to be exact. Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventure is a very thrilling roller coaster. A lot goes on in this coaster. Besides the great theming, you have multiple launches, you have a drop track, you have a backward section. That one makes me a little sick by the way. But this, all in all, a very thrilling Wizarding World ride. And I would like to note, for those of you who do not like to go upside down, unlike the Hulk, this ride, Hagrid's Magical Preacher's Motorbike Adventure, will not take you upside down. No inversions on this roller coaster. The next attraction that Universal classifies as a thrill ride, a little odd, but not the real odd one that I mentioned at the beginning of the video, that's for later. But Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey is listed by Universal as a thrill ride. 
maybe it's just a matter of it's not a water ride it's not a 3d ride and maybe it's not really considered a kid ride so it had to fall into the thrill category it would not make any list i made of top thrill rides at universal however it does make a list of rides that will make you sick however you want to classify this ride a thrill ride a kid ride a 2d ride a family friendly ride whatever you want to classify it as it is a must do ride for any harry potter fan all done with islands of adventure thrill rides now i'm going to head into universal studios florida and show you its thrill rides before we step inside for the second half of the list, I would like to remind you that I publish theme park videos on this channel all the time. So click that subscribe button and that bell notification button so you'll know when another video is ready for you to view. And also, go subscribe to my road trip channel. It's all the fun stuff to do in Florida outside of the theme parks. I'll leave a link. Go check that one out. Let's kickstart your heart and kickstart the second half of this list with Rip Ride Rocket. Ah, kickstart, a little play on words as kickstart my heart is my wife's favorite song to play on this roller coaster. Yes, you do get to pick your own song when you go on this coaster. For a lot of people, the most thrilling aspect of this ride is the climb up. And for a lot of people, the main reason why they don't go on this ride. But to me, it's just a relaxing climb up. Just lean back and relax, people. I would also like to mention that this is the fastest ride at this park, Universal Studios Florida. Velocicoaster is the fastest at Islands of Adventure. And for those of you who do not like to go upside down, this one has no inversions. You may be second guessing what I'm saying to you as you look at this loop, but there's a corkscrew at the top of this loop, so technically you do not go upside down. If half of your party finds it too thrilling to go on and the other half is brave enough to do it, the first half, they can just hang out here on the lawn and watch you have fun. Next up in this beginner's guide to Universal Studios thrill rides, we have the Revenge of the Mummy roller coaster. This is an indoor roller coaster. It's dark, fast, and fun. There are no inversions on this indoor roller coaster. However, there are a few spots that will cause you to have some airtime and lose your stomach, and those are very thrilling. And I would say for this theme park, Universal Studios Florida, the Mummy is my favorite ride. Now the other park, Islands of Adventure, it bounces between Hagrid's, the Hulk, and Velocicoaster. Just depends on my mood. Those last two items, Rip Ride Rocket and the Mummy, pretty obvious. Now the list gets a little wonky. The Simpsons ride is listed on the app as a thrill ride. I know why it's not listed as a 3D ride, even though it has a large screen, the screen is a 2D screen, not a 3D screen. And maybe it is a bit too thrilling to be listed as a kid ride, but for me, not a thrill ride, it does make my list of rides, however, that will make you sick. And then MIB Men in Black Alien Attack is listed as a thrill attraction here at Universal Orlando. This one I can kind of understand because at the very end of the ride, there is a very wicked spinning part. I mean, it really spins you. So that is thrilling. So in my opinion, MIB deserved to be on this list more so than The Simpsons, but I don't control the app. Escape from Gringotts, not listed on the app as a thrill ride, but you know what is? Fast and Furious, supercharged the thrill ride. Again, maybe this is a case, there's no other classification to put it. It is a screen ride, but the screen is 2D, not 3D. Obviously, it's not a water ride. So the other options would be thrill ride or kid ride, and they chose to go with thrill. Again, this would not make any list of mine for thrill ride. It would, however, for cues, and I think I did do a video on that. It did make my list of top cues, and bonus, it offers a garage tour. Ask for that when you're here. Just remember that any of the backstage tours that you request are not guaranteed. That just depends on the staffing level 
of the attraction at the time you ask. But the garage tour that they do here, I will show in a future video. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, there are four categories of rides they have here. Thrill rides, water rides, 3D rides, and kids rides. If you wanna see a video about kids rides, click this video right here. And as always, don't miss the magic, don't miss the fun. Thanks for watching Rich Flicks. And now, click that subscribe button.